you are studying a sample with n equals to 4 scores, the sum of x equals 8, and the sum of x squared equals to 46. Determine the value of the sum of the squared deviations for the sample. Is it 6, 8, 30, or 54? Now we have two formulas for sum of squares. The first one we're not going to be able to use because it requires that we either know the uh, sum of the squared deviations, which we don't, or at least we would need to know the individual values and the value of the sample mean. That's supposed to be an M, a capital M there. So we can't work this one out. We can, however, use the computational formula because that requires that we know the sum of x squared, which we do. We also need to know the sum of x, which we do. We're going to put that in brackets and square it. And we need to know the sample size. Again, we have that piece of information. So we just plug these in. We're going to put in 46 and we're going to minus the sum of x in brackets, so that's 8. Square that and divide by 4. Okay, so 8 squared is 64, divided by 4 is, I believe, 16. 64 divided by 4 is 16, so this is going to be 46 minus 16, which is equals to 30, making our answer C, 30.